Logging on to ePropertySites.com is very simple. All you need to do is go to www.ePropertySites.com to get started. Once you are at www.ePropertySites.com, you'll need your login and your password that you created when you signed up for the service. In the bottom right corner, you'll see a login box. Just enter your login ID and your password, and optionally, you can click one of the choices below the login button to save your login information. So we'll type in our login name and our password. Now you can choose to save your login and your password if you're the only one that uses your computer. You can also choose to save only your login ID or if you're using a public computer, I would choose to not save either. That way nobody else can get into your account. So once you've entered your name and your password, you're just going to click login and there you are in your ePropertySites.com account. If you forget your password, just enter your login name and then just guess at a password. You can just enter one, two, three, whatever you want or whatever you think it is. Then click login and it's gonna take you to a screen that says your password is incorrect. So then you're gonna click here if you forgot your login ID or password you're going to enter in either your login ID or your email address, click search, and it will send an email to your email address with your password information. So I entered in my login ID, I click search, and it says an email has been sent to me with my login information. And logging into ePropertySites is that simple.